Hello, I'm Kevin DeSmet. I'm a student at Learning Alias, and this is going to be another Come Get Some Alias video. So what I have here is a door mirror, and you can see I've started from a mesh, and I've already got a lot of it done. But now I need a little patch here to finish it off, and then that's going to get trimmed back. So let me just get started on that. I'm going to choose to use the monorail tool for this. So this is going to be my gen curve and my rail curve and I want to use the curve segments if I turn this on and off you can see these little uh, manipulators so I'm just gonna drag it to the right so let's see to about where that fillet would start or stop and what I wanted to show you is if I turn on the CV hull and I ask for continuity, I don't have continuity. I have a small deviation over here and I have a fair deviation over here. And really at first I thought, let me turn the CV hulls back off, that it was because this edge and this edge were not edge aligned. There's a skew. So at first I thought, well, I'm going to have to live with this. But not so much. Look at the CV structure. It seems pretty good along this direction, but this direction seems a little bunched up, like more than I need. So I've got a 5.5 five right now. That's pretty standard. So let me see whether I can make that less. Now I have curvature continuity and the footprint of the surface looks much more uh, even. So you can see that the aspect ratio of a surface of the CVs can be a determinant whether you get continuity or not. Less sometimes really is more. Again, I've been Kevin Smet, a student at Learning Alias. This has been a two-minute Come Get Some Alias video.